what's up guys it's adam from nerdology lab and i'll be totally honest i am super excited about this video today i've been waiting two weeks for this package to come in so i could put this video out to you guys um now that i'm more getting into nerf and whatnot nerf modding things such as that i figured this right here is something that every nerf modder has to have it's like essential to nerf modding so let's go ahead and take it out of the box bum, bum, bum. oh yeah that's right baby i ordered a strife the strife comes with a six round mag a modulus barrel attachment and ah, there we go one instruction booklet of course i mean granted nobody ever reads these things comes with six modulus darts and a foregrip so let's uh let's attach this foregrip right here all right now let's take an out of the box overview get rid of that okay so here is just a quick overview of the blaster so like i said it comes with this foregrip this is just a basic Actually, very nice, comfortable foregrip, I'm not going to lie. And it comes with a front barrel attachment. Nice front barrel attachment, to be quite honest. But let's set those aside right now. We're just going to look at the core blaster. Ooh. Half clear mag six-round magazine. I actually like that a lot. All right. So, let's put in the batteries real quick. Put in the batteries is fairly simple. Would be simple if I had the right screwdriver. Jordan, would you mind getting my other screwdriver, my number one? Big handled one. Other side. Nope, other side. I need one. That's the one. Right over here, please. Alright. So, like I said. Undo that. Pop open the hatch. Alright. Four double A's. Bust open our big pack of double A's. The batteries that I'm running in this are... Thunderbolt Magnum AA batteries. The same batteries that I run in my uh, Nerf Alpha Strike Flight CS10. So if you haven't seen that video, go ahead and check that one out as well. That will be in my channel. Let's make sure that we got enough batteries right here. Only grab two. Need four. One. And that makes four. Okay. So, install these. Ah! I'm, I swear that doesn't usually happen. Reinstall the battery door. Need the right screwdriver. Alright, now that the batteries are in, gotta have the magazine in because of pesky lock. All right, that is nice. Okay, now let's go for a firing demo. All right, guys, so first things first, as are with every firing demo I do, we're going to start with the darts that it comes with and the magazine that it comes with. So, these are the Modulus Elite darts. Give it a second to power up. Alright, not bad. Next, we're going to go with some elites. Regular blue elites in a plain orange uh, elite magazine. Alright, also not bad at all. And finally, to finish it off, AccuStrike darts in the Raptor Strike 6 round magazine. firing goes not bad at all to be quite honest this thing's awesome i am curious to see what would happen with um a flywheel modification as well as a slight battery upgrade not sure if i want to do that yet or not frankly um i like running them the way they are with the mechanics that are in them as far as electronics go uh just because i have two little sisters that i like to play with 
And, you know, when, when it comes to playing with them, I don't want them to get hurt, you know. But, every once in a while, it is funny. So, that's why I've been working on collecting up a whole bunch of these uh, flywheel electronic blasters. So that things are a little bit more balanced when we decide to play and have fun and stuff like that. And frankly, I think this is going to be a great blaster for me to just like pew pew them with and have a lot of fun. Um, as far as attachments go, I kind of wish that it had come with the stock just because this foregrip, you know, I feel like there should be a stock on it. it makes me want to push it back. Uh, but of course, you know, take that off and boom, boom, boom. And this barrel attachment, super nice. But I also think that it works for just a great, you know, little sidearm blaster pistol that's semi-auto without having to be, um, you know, constantly, you know, charged or anything like that. Uh, the ergonomics of the blaster, I think, are amazing. This comp is, the, this grip is very comfortable, uh, as well as so is the foregrip. Um... I already bought a trigger kit for it, so that's going to be the next video replacing this switch, uh, the rev switch, and the magazine release. So that's what uh, that's what the next video with this blaster is going to be. Um, debating if I'm going to be using uh, these attachments. I mean, the foregrip is awesome, especially because I'm so used to using a demolisher, uh, which you know that that pump is just insane. So the foregrip's nice, it's a nice change for me personally, I like it a lot. Um, probably going to be looking into getting some more modulus attachments, and of course doing an upgrade on this. My only complaint overall about this blaster is this. Hasbro is getting cheap on us. You know, right here, nice beautiful lime green, co lime green color, nice modulus uh, battery tray door says nerf in black here on the front but then you come to this side and it's just like hasbro what the heck man <laughs> um i mean these blasters are so amazing you would think that they would spend just a few extra cents to paint this side because you imagine if that green stripe was on here that'd just be awesome all right but yeah anyway so that is my review unboxing and review of the nerf modulus strife Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, especially if you have any questions about what it is that I do with these blasters or what I plan on doing with them. If you want to see something specific on the channel, make sure you comment it. Also, like, subscribe, already mentioned that, and have a great day, guys. Thanks for watching.